X-ray tube. X-ray tube is a vacuum tube that produces X-rays. It consists of a glass envelope which is made up of Pyrex glass. This glass protects and provides a vacuumated environment. The glass has a target window which is a thinning of the glass. The cathode is made up of tungsten filament and has high melting point. The anode is also made up of tungsten. Both of these are connected to high voltage output. Cathode is connected to the negative end and anode to the positive end. The cathode is heated and produces electrons through thermoionic emission. The produced electrons travel from cathode towards the anode and hit the anode, hence it is also called as target. Once they are hit, two effects come into place, the photoelectric effect and Bremsstrahlung effect. Thus, X-rays are produced. When electron strikes the target, that is the anode, 99% is converted into heat and only 1% is converted into X-rays. Therefore, in modern X-ray tube, rotating anode is present, which will have heats at various positions. Therefore, it will have less heat generation or more heat capacity. Exceptions are portable radiographic and dental X-rays. This is the X-ray tube. And these are the X-rays that are being generated some scatter radiation and this is a mixed energy this is the patient and this is the cassette the x-rays travel through the patient and reach the cassette but however there are two types of radiations here type A radiation is stopped after reaching the patient so they do not hit the film so they do not form an image hence they are useless and cause unnecessary radiation to the patient type B hits the film and helps form the image therefore they are necessary A is low energy and B is high energy. This is a filter. This blocks the low energy waves and removes unnecessary radiation that is radiation A. This is a collimator which restricts the X-ray path and reduces the scatter radiation thus giving a direction to the X-ray beam. This is the grid. Grid allows only straight X-rays to pass from the patient to the cassette. It is made up of parallelly arranged lead blocks. It improves the quality of the image at the cost of increasing radiation to the patient. This is the screen. Screen is made up of calcium tungstate. And this is the single film. And this is the double film. Both of these are made up of silver bromide. 